they flew 120 feet in 12 seconds. 12 seconds that changed the history of mankind forever. Photographs are a window into the past. They're intricate storytellers that freeze moments in time, preserving memories and narratives for generations to come. Unfortunately, some of the snapshots that speak volumes about the remarkable journey of mankind are not well known. Those that are known are also gradually forgotten, but we'll be revisiting them. Join us as we explore 25 of the rare photographs from the history of mankind. Number 25, Mount Everest's first successful ascent. This incredible photo was taken on May 29, 1953, during the first successful ascent of Mount Everest. In this picture, you see two remarkable individuals standing proudly at the summit of Mount Everest. On one side, there's Sir Edmund Hillary from New Zealand, and on the other, Tenzing Norgay, a Sherpa from Nepal. These two figures embody determination, courage, and the spirit of human achievement. The picture captures a raw and authentic moment. You can see it in their faces, the wind-bitten skin, the exhaustion from the journey, and yet a profound sense of accomplishment and elation. Their ascent was a symbol of collaboration and unity among different cultures. This single photograph freezing their triumphant moment became an iconic symbol of human potential and the pursuit of the extraordinary. Number 24. The Construction of the Eiffel Tower Among the famous boulevards and cool buildings of 1888 Paris, something new was taking shape piece by piece. This old photo shows the framework of what was about to become the Eiffel Tower, one of the most famous sites on the planet. In the snapshot, you see the tower in progress, not fully built yet. There are guys up there working on the beams. It's truly a snapshot of human cleverness and bravery. The Eiffel Tower idea was brought up by a guy named Gustav Eiffel for an event in 1889 called the Exposition Universales. However, when they started building it, some Parisians weren't all that thrilled. Some were even upset about it. As seen, this picture captures the tower at that stage when it was just a concept coming to life. It's a symbol of moving forward, of what people can do when they put their minds to it. Today, the Eiffel Tower is more than just a cool piece of engineering. It's like a symbol of love, art, and thinking in a totally new way. Number 23, Diving Suit, the Inventor. In this photograph, you can see a diving suit, and it's quite intriguing. This was not just any diving suit. It was freshly patented by the inventive mind of Charles E. McGuffey. The suit tips the scales at a hefty 550 pounds, and it's constructed from aluminum alloy, which was quite a forward-thinking choice for the time. Now there's Mr. McGuffey, standing next to his creation with a proud stance. And he has every reason to be proud because, in 1914, the suit set a new record by diving to a jaw-dropping depth of 212 feet in the Long Island Sound. This suit, designed in 1911, is a symbol of the innovation and ambition that accompanied the thirst for uncovering the mysteries hidden beneath the waves. Number 22. The Titanic's Departure The RMS Titanic, this marvel of human skill and luxury was all prepped for its very first journey to New York City on April 12, 1912. This photo of the ship leaving has an eerie calm about it. You can feel that the people had no clue about the tragedy that was lurking for both the ship and everyone on it. The sun's bouncing off the ship's clean white sides and the crowd is waving their handkerchiefs, all psyched about this epic journey on what they thought was an unsinkable ship. On board, there were some of the richest people of that time, mixed with hopeful immigrants and adventurers seeking some action. Little did they know that this picture wouldn't just capture the start of a trip, but also sort of hint at one of the worst sea disasters ever. The Titanic's massive presence in that image sticks with us, reminding us how people take huge risks, how delicate life can be, and how fate can throw us off course. Number 21, the first color photograph. There was a time when every picture was made in black and white. But then, a game changer that promised to splash the full spectrum of life onto images was invented in 1861. At the center of this whole deal is a photo showing off a tartan ribbon. This was back in the day when color photography was still finding its feet. And the masterminds behind this were James Clerk Maxwell and photographer Thomas Sutton in Paris. 
These people tried out a trick using three separate black and white photos. Each one was snapped through a different colored filter, red, green, and blue. When they stacked these photos on top of each other, they brought out the vivid colors of that ribbon. It was like discovering a hidden treasure, and that picture marked the beginning of a whole new era, a time when the snapshots we took could finally capture the world in all its glorious hues. Number 20. The Hindenburg Disaster On this day in Lakehurst, New Jersey, the LZ-129 Hindenburg, a German airship, was almost done with its journey across the Atlantic. However, within moments, the whole scene goes from hopeful to utterly chilling. There's a photo from that evening that captures the intensity of the moment. The massive Zeppelin is caught up in raging flames. You see its tail collapsing, and at the front, it's like it is trying to rise in an attempt to escape from the blazing inferno. Down on the ground, there are these tiny figures running around in panic. This Hindenburg was meant to be this symbol of luxury and speed, but it ended in tragedy on May 6, 1937. It took the lives of 36 people. The photo is a snapshot of how human ambitions can crash into the unpredictability of fate. It serves as a lasting reminder of how early aviation wasn't all smooth sailing, having its share of risks and dangers. Number 19. Mahatma Gandhi Spinning Yarn Let's step back to 1930 in India, specifically to the Sabarmati Ashram. There's this snapshot that captures a confident man with his glasses on, wrapped in a simple loincloth. This man is none other than Mahatma Gandhi, the key player in India's quest for independence. He's seen deeply focused on spinning yarn using this traditional spinning wheel called a charka. Now, spinning yarn might not sound like much, but for Gandhi it was loaded with meaning. It was a symbol of self-reliance, a stance against British goods, and a call for Indians to back their own industries. This snapshot isn't just a glimpse of a leader doing an everyday task. It's a massive political statement. Gandhi's spinning wheel turned into this powerful tool against colonial rule, encouraging millions to see strength in simplicity and self-sustainability. This image is etched in our shared history, serving as a reminder of how resistance can be both understated and incredibly impactful. Number 18. Hiroshima after the atomic bomb. Back on August 6, 1945, it was a serene dawn in Hiroshima. Everything was quiet and peaceful. However, history books were rewritten on this day when suddenly a blinding flash engulfed the whole city. After it was over, we found this photo that captured the scene. It's beyond what words can explain. In the picture, you can see that a city that was once alive and bustling is now nothing but rubble. The whole landscape has become like a creepy wasteland. Shadows of objects and even people are also burned into the concrete and stone. It's like these ghostly marks left behind, a moment stuck in time forever. Number 17. The First Flight of the Wright Brothers Back on December 17, 1903, in Kitty Hawk, North Carolina, two brothers, Orville and Wilbur Wright, set up a flying machine on the sandy shores, all set to achieve something that people had been dreaming about for ages. This endeavor to fly in a controlled way made them famous. A cool old photo also captures that exact moment. You can see Orville in the pilot's seat of the right flyer while Wilbur is right beside him, a mix of hope and nerves on his face. Now this wasn't a usual airplane flight. It was a leap of human ambition. The Wright brothers pulled off something pretty epic in just 12 seconds. They managed to fly that machine for 120 feet. It might sound short now, but that first flight was a game changer, and it set the stage for modern aviation as we know it. All the airplanes crossing continents and oceans, making our huge world feel small and connected, is all thanks to those 12 seconds in the air that the Wright brothers owned. Number 16. The Canals of Venice A different side of Venice comes into focus in 1956. In this snapshot, you're getting a behind-the-scenes look at a section of one of Venice's renowned canals. But there's a twist. It's not filled with shimmering water as you might expect. Instead, it's been deliberately drained and cordoned off. The laborers in the picture are the ones making it happen. With determination and sweat, they've managed to clear out all the sludge and muck that can accumulate over time. Venice's canals are a defining feature of the city, and keeping them in top shape is a massive undertaking. 
Those workers you see are the unsung heroes, putting in the effort to ensure that Venice's charm and functionality remain intact. So when you're looking at this picture, you're not just seeing a drained canal. You're witnessing a slice of the hard work and dedication that goes into preserving the beauty and essence of a city that's built on water. It's a tribute to the hands-on efforts that keep iconic places like Venice thriving. Number 15. Marilyn Monroe's Iconic Dress Scene Traveling back to 1954, we find ourselves in the lively streets of New York City, right in the heart of Manhattan. Amid the hustling and bustling of the city, a stunning blonde figure graced the scene. Marilyn Monroe's laughter echoed through the air, and her posture radiated an undeniable allure. She was then captured in a photograph that would become an iconic tableau. Her white dress playfully danced in the breeze from the subway grates, adding to the magic of the moment. This scene was part of the film, The Seven Year Itch, but its impact extended far beyond the movie screen. Monroe wasn't just an actress playing a role in that instant. She embodied the spirit of post-war America, a mix of innocence and irresistible charm. The photograph is also a perfect study in contrast. Her luminous presence stands out against the gritty urban backdrop of the city, and her playful manner contradicts the more formal attire of the onlookers around her. Number 14. First Woman to Vote in a Modern Election this photo from the late 19th century captures a pivotal moment in history. The picture showcases a woman standing outside a polling station, and her presence in that photo tells an inspiring story of progress and change. This woman, dressed modestly, but with a determination in her eyes, is about to cast her vote. And this isn't just any vote. It's a vote that symbolizes a huge step towards gender equality. She's not alone in this movement. Being among the first women to exercise their newly acquired right to vote in a modern democratic setup is a leap that challenges centuries of disenfranchisement and sets the stage for a more inclusive society. As you look at the photo, you can almost sense the weight of the moment. The folds of her attire, the ballot in her hand, and the expression on her face all speak volumes about the courage it took to challenge the status quo and demand equal representation. Number 13. Armstrong on the Moon in the vast, star-studded space where ancient light twinkles and Earth hangs like a radiant blue gem, history was made. Back on July 20th, 1969, this photo captured Neil Armstrong, all suited up and bulky, planting the first human footprint on the moon's dusty surface. The photo is surreal. You can see Armstrong's reflection in Buzz Aldrin's visor. It's like a photo within a photo. Also, the totally barren moon's surface stretches out into infinity. This achievement wasn't just for the United States, it was a win for all humans, showing that when we are determined and we put our minds to it, even those faraway stars aren't beyond our grasp. Number 12. Einstein at the Blackboard In a dimly lit room covered in chalk dust and eraser smudges at Oxford University, we can see a physicist standing with wild hair, jotting down equations. This was back in 1931, and the physicist was Albert Einstein the brain behind the theory of relativity. In this famous photo of him from that time, he was caught in the act of writing down that super famous equation, E equal to max square. However, that picture is way more than just some symbols and numbers. The picture is a snapshot of how we humans are always itching to crack the universe's code. You look at Einstein with his droopy sweater and intense, sharp eyes, and you get what it means to be dead serious about science. He was about pushing the limits, trying to understand things that seemed impossible. When you check out those chalk marks and notes, you can almost hear the rustling of paper, the quiet chatter of deep thoughts, and that mellow yet fiery dedication that changed up the world of physics. Number 11. Game of Human Chess 1924 in Russia was a time when people knew how to turn a classic game into something truly spectacular. This picture captures a scene showing a game of human chess played on a grand scale. This massive chess board wasn't filled with pieces, but real people. You can almost feel the excitement in the air as each move is carefully planned and executed. Now this isn't your everyday casual game. It's a spectacle, a way to bring a beloved strategy game to life. And let's not forget that this is happening in Soviet Russia, a place known for its unique approach to pretty much everything. So, who knows, maybe there was an extra layer of intensity in this human chess match. Number 10. 
first image of Earth from space. The first image of Earth was captured from space on October 4, 1946. A camera was attached to a 5-2 missile soaring high above our planet, capturing a view that had never been seen before. You can see the Earth's curve against the backdrop of space in this picture. It looks like a delicate, finite sphere suspended in the vastness of the cosmos. This photograph was taken from an altitude of 65 miles above the Earth's surface, marking a significant milestone in human exploration. Now, the photo might not be as crystal clear as the ones we're used to today. It's in black and white and has a grainy quality. However, the implications of that image were profound. It was a holistic view that showed Earth as one interconnected entity, emphasizing its fragility and the thin veil of atmosphere that keeps us safe from the harshness of space. Number 9. Mother Teresa in Calcutta Slums The alleys of Calcutta's slums were places where hope often struggled against despair. Back in the 1980s, Mother Teresa visited the slums, and this photo shows her holding a malnourished child, her eyes reflecting a love that knows no bounds. She's living proof that kindness can make a real difference, and her purpose wasn't just to offer physical help. It was to bring back dignity to those who felt overlooked. In that image, Mother Teresa isn't a distant, unreachable saint or a person with a fancy award. Instead, she's a nurturing presence, a calming reassurance that even in the darkest corners, love can find its way. The picture is a powerful testament to her unwavering commitment, a reminder that even when things are tough, there's room for endless empathy and grace. Number 8. Construction of the Statue of Liberty The 1880s were a time of immense construction and innovation. One picture from this era captures a pivotal moment in history, the snapshot taken during the construction of the Statue of Liberty. In this photograph, you get a glimpse behind the scenes of the statue's creation. You see the framework, the scaffolding, and the intense labor that went into crafting this symbol of freedom and hope. It's like a backstage pass to history, revealing the dedication and hard work that went into making Lady Liberty stand tall. A remarkable fact about this construction is that it reflects the ideals and aspirations of that time. The Statue of Liberty was a gift from France to the United States, symbolizing friendship and freedom. So when you look at this picture, you're not just seeing steel and scaffolding, you're also witnessing the birth of an enduring symbol that would come to represent the values of a nation and inspire people for generations to come. Number 7. MLK, Jr. Delivering I Have a Dream Speech Martin Luther King Jr. stood in front of the Lincoln Memorial speaking, and his voice carried the weight of struggles endured over countless years and dreams that were kept waiting for far too long. In this photo, you see him right in the middle of a speech, with his face radiating with passion and unwavering resolve. That day was a big day on August 28, 1963, and thousands had gathered for the march on Washington. But in that one crucial moment, it wasn't just the crowd, but King's voice that seemed to echo the hopes of generations. He said, I have a dream. With those words, he stirred something deep within everyone. He talked about a dream where even a place like Mississippi, seething with injustice, would eventually be transformed. Number 6. The Beatles' First Visit to the U.S. This was a legendary moment in pop culture history. On February 7, 1964, four young men from Liverpool stepped off the plane at JFK Airport in New York. There's a sense of electricity in the air, and you can't help but notice their distinctive mop-top haircuts and their sharp suits. These men are known as the Beatles, and they are not just any musicians. They're a phenomenon in the making. The energy around them is explosive. Fans are screaming their lungs out, and journalists are basically in a frenzy trying to catch a glimpse of these guys. This moment marks the very beginning of the British invasion, a time when British bands like the Beatles stormed the U.S. music scene. Their impact was extraordinary. Their music was like a breath of fresh air and their charisma was undeniable. This picture was a glimpse into the start of a journey that would captivate the American audience and transform the music landscape forever. Now, let's have our subscribers pick for today. Some fascinating things are happening in these pictures. Starting from the second image, we see this lady holding a mirror and a gun over her shoulder. The lady, known as Annie Oakley, is a sharpshooting legend. 
Oakley was undeniably a top-notch shooter of her time, and what set her apart wasn't just her marksmanship, it was her knack for shaping her image. She chose to emphasize modesty, as we can see in the skirt she's wearing. This makes her relatable and appealing to a diverse range of people for various reasons. However, in this picture, she seems to be looking at herself in the mirror while shooting a range, or is she? The first picture shows a woman dressed extravagantly, posing for a picture. This image has caused a lot of confusion as some people claim she is Queen Genepal, while others claim she's just a regular Mongolian woman dressed as the Queen. Let's hear your in the comments section. Number 5. The Fall of the Berlin Wall On November 9, 1989, Berlin was gripped by a chilly breeze, yet the air was pulsating with sheer excitement. There's this remarkable photograph from that night, and it's like a time capsule bursting with emotions. A mass of people was armed with tools, chipping away at the once mighty Berlin Wall. This wall stood tall for nearly 30 years, not only physically dividing East and West Berlin, but also symbolizing the huge gap between communism and democracy. In that photo, faces are lit up by floodlights and street lamps. You can see the mix of shock and joy all rolled into one. Each strike against the wall was like a global wish for unity, freedom, and the end of that Cold War era. Some people even climbed on top, holding hands, waving flags, and singing songs of liberation. When the Berlin Wall fell, it wasn't just chunks of concrete collapsing, it was the whole era crumbling down. That one snapshot captures a moment of collective victory, where people from all walks of life celebrated the beginning of a new chapter, marked by unity and a whole lot of hope. Number 4. Helen Keller and Charlie Chaplin Back in 1919, two remarkable figures from different realms came together for a moment that would be captured in a photograph. In this image, you're witnessing the meeting of Helen Keller and Charlie Chaplin, a true blend of inspiration and entertainment. Helen Keller was a beacon of advocacy for the deaf and blind. On the other side, there's Charlie Chaplin, the iconic film actor who brought joy to audiences worldwide. In the photograph, you'll notice something quite incredible. Helen Keller, who couldn't hear or see, is engaged in a unique form of communication with Chaplin. She's reading his lips by gently touching his mouth, using her extraordinary sense of touch to understand his words. It's a testament to the power of human interaction and understanding. And while their encounter might have been brief, this photograph immortalizes a meeting that resonates with the potential for unity and shared experiences, regardless of our differences. Number 3. Mandela's Release from Prison as the gates of Victor Verster Prison swung open on February 11, 1990, a man whose name had practically become a symbol of strength, courage, and optimism walked out. Of course, he was none other than Nelson Mandela. After an unbelievable 27 years of being locked up, he finally stepped out into a world that had been counting down the days to his release. You can see this snapshot captures that moment perfectly. Mandela standing with his fist up in a quiet yet powerful victory stance, and right beside him is his wife, Winnie. Their hands are locked together, and you can sense the determination radiating from them. This was like a fresh start for all of South Africa. All around them, there's a sea of people, faces all lit up with happiness, waving the flag of the African National Congress. It's like they're saying, goodbye to the era of apartheid. We're done with that. Number two. Montana. Back in 1901, eligible bachelors were in the spotlight. Ladies were on the lookout for suitable husbands, and in came this group of Montana men, all ready to step up to the plate. In the photograph, we have these Montana men, standing tall and probably more than willing to offer their services as potential partners. It's a slice of history that reflects the social dynamics of the time, and it's a blend of seeking companionship, forming families, and perhaps even a bit of adventure. Number 1. Dolly Beside His Artwork Inside a well-lit studio in Spain, you can see brushes, colors, and creative tools everywhere you look. Also, right there in the midst of it all stands a guy who's as fascinating as the art he creates. Salvador Dali. There's this photo taken in 1948 that gives us a glimpse of him next to one of his mind-bending artworks called The Elephants. In the snapshot, you can't miss Dolly's upturned mustache and his intense gaze. 
It's like he's inviting you to step into this world he's crafted, filled with warped realities and dreamy scenes. The painting he's standing by features two elephants, but they're not like the ones you'd see in a zoo. They have long, fragile legs that seem to defy gravity as they carry these massive obelisks on their backs. This photo gives us a special peek into Dali's brilliance. It doesn't just show us an artist, it reveals a visionary who wasn't afraid to mess with our perception of reality, pushing the boundaries of what art can do. These pictures captured memorable moments in our history, helping us keep the memories intact. The beauty and fascination of their significance will surely stay with us for a very long time. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one.